Hello everyone, I'm Ricky Mario Frank bringing you the 4.01 M33 and M332 update for your PSP Slim. You hear that? Slim. I recommend this program for no for no one under 390 M33. This is you. Mess up your PSP, I have no responsibility for doing that whatsoever. So, I had a uh, 390 M33, I updated, but then... The video was bad, so I'm doing it all over again. I'm just telling you what's gonna happen. So first thing you want to do is get the 401M33 update, the 401M33 and the M332 update, and the PBP. You can find them at psbhacks.com, but I'll have the links in my description box. This is the M33 and the M332 update. Get those. You need those in order to do this whole thing. I hate these pop-ups. I really do. And the PBP is in the 401M33 released uh, section under 401M33 update. I don't know why they have them separate. I have no idea what's going on. Okay, so, so now what you want to do is... Just so you know, I'm not, I'm not talking shit. Here's my video. There it is, 401M332. I can guarantee... No, I can guarantee this. But it worked for me, so it should work for you. Oh, and before I start... I start, I really start anything. Back up your CXMB and your SE plugins, or whatever else you use, your IR shells, whatever. And your uh, game screen loaders. Because they will be erased. I have no idea why, but they will be. Mines are gone, that's why my PSP looks plain. I have to get them back. I'll show you that in another video. So what you want to do now is... Go to your PSP. And go to... Your USB connection. And open that. This will pop up for you to open folder to view files. It's the last one that... Uh, it's the uh, nearly last one you can use. Open that, and here you are. Open your PSP game folder. This is, this is my 401 MTC2 update file, but I really don't need this right now. Never will need it again. Since you've already gotten Winwar, uh, you have to unzip them. I did this previously, but never used it, and I, used, I didn't use it until today. So, here's the 401 M33 update and the 401 M332 update. This is all you'll need. God damn that. Now for your M33 update, you need to drag the PBP. I renamed it because I think that was necessary because uh, it was named the same thing after the Ebu PBP, which you can't see. That's the 401 M that's the 401 PBP right there. Place that in your update folder for your 401M33 update. And that's for m just in case I missed it. What you want to do is carry the update folder or copy it to your PSP game folder. Uh, go to your PSP. Uh, go to game, memory card, and it'll be the first thing on your list. Here's an example. It's right there. You can activate it. It'll scan the PSP for all required stuff and non what whatever. What the installing time will take like uh, three three and a half minutes or so or four minutes. I I forgot. But it's not gonna take that long. And after that's done, you can do the same thing for your MCC too, but you don't need the 401 PPP anymore. So, yeah. You're pretty, pretty much in the clear after that. And that's how I got my 401 MP, M362. I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Uh, I know I have a bit of problems talking and stuff and recording camera angles because my, my camera doesn't have a tripod stand. It's up on my PSP casing, as you can see. And I did the best I could. Uh, enjoy the video, enjoy the custom firmware, and now you can place your themes, 
SE plugins, CXMB, whatever, back on, because you're good to go. This is Ricky Marlfang. Hope you like my stuff.